Hello everybody and welcome back. It's Jenny and it's time to do our Wednesday daily deal and you know that's going to save you money on your grocery bill and you want to know so come on in like and share the video on your way in and if you're not one of our crazy friends and you're just stopping by kind of sampling the waters well look below and hit that subscription button and that notification bell because I guarantee you this channel will save you money. <laughs> and you'll want to come back so you don't forget and you don't miss any of our deals, deals, glitches, free stuff, or awesome information. Make sure you hit that red subscription button. And make sure your notifications are on all. Alright, everybody. Like I said, it is Wednesday. And Wednesday we dedicate, or try to, saving money on our grocery bill. And a lot of us only have well, two choices in my case for local groceries. The local Harps grocery store, Dollar General, or Family Dollar. Okay? Those are my three choices. Now, I could drive quite a ways to Walmart. But, you know, depending on what my needs are at the time. But even so, if you do price comparisons at Walmart when it comes to some items, they're still cheaper at the Dollar General because you get $5 off every $25 transaction. So if you're doing more than one $25 transaction in Dollar General, you should be using your paper 5 off 25s or your digital 5 off 25s because you can do as many transactions as you want. Just not all at one time. Do two. Take your stuff to the car. Come back. Do a couple more. Go to another store. I mean, there's several ways that you could do multiple transactions and find everything that you need. So, yes. And, you know, get multiple accounts as well. But the paper 5 off of 25s, they're super easy to get. You just go in the store, purchase something. Go over to the self-checkout. They're just hanging out all over the self-checkout. So, pick one up. Two, three, four. Depending on how big a grocery bill you got. <laughs> Alright, guys. First off, we're going to talk about this any day deal. I hope you took advantage of your Jif and your Smuckers deal. But, uh, if you didn't, you missed out, guys. You can still get a dollar off on your Fetch. If you get these products, make sure you submit your receipt to Fetch. And if you don't know what Fetch is, it's a rebate app that will give you money back on things that you're using coupons for at the Dollar General. So if you've used, if you picked up the GIF and the Smuckers, make sure you get Fetch if you don't have it, number one. And uh, you can get it at any Play Store here I'm going to put my Fetch referral code. They'll give you a little money to start with. But uh, Fetch pays you for every receipt you scan. Up to seven, I think, a day. So, yeah. Good way to save. It's like putting money in the bank after you done spent the money. And save the money. So, that being said, we have a coupon that expires tomorrow. And it's that Truvia sweetener. Now, this is on sale for $1.95. You get this $1.50 coupon, okay? Go pick that up. This is emergency food. I mean, in an emergency situation, you still want to have some sweet. So, this is a good way to have it. It is a plant-based sweetener, and it's cheap. Now, next, our deal, any day deal, is going to be the three Pepsi 12-packs. Three for fifteen, two dollar coupon coming off is going to leave you thirteen dollars out of pocket. That's your any day deal number one. Any day deal number two is this Nabisco glitching coupon. Okay, this two dollar off when you spend uh, nine dollars. Well, you're going to pick up two of the honey made graham crackers. Okay, they are uh, eight dollars for two. And you're going to get this $2 off because it's glitching and not picking up the sale price. So you can have peanut butter jelly graham crackers, guys. Now, we just had a new earn post that will attach to this coupon. 
so I don't have it on my scenario page. And that urn is for these three ninety five Ritz original toasted chips. Okay. And it is a limit of five, but it's a dollar fifty urn. So that's a good chunk off of this three ninety five and you can use it up to five times. So if you wanted to do this instead of the honey made graham crackers, you could do that. The two dollar Nabisco coupon's gonna attach to that, as well as uh You'll get your three dollars in earns back. Okay, guys, I'm going to skip to this, which is our math page, and we're talking about our any day deals. We've got any day deal number one, three Pepsi twelve packs. You out of pocket for that's going to be thirteen dollars. Um, you got a two dollar coupon. Any day deal number two, it's the glitching Nabisco coupon. We're going to pick up two of those honey made graham crackers. Okay. And that's, you know, $2 off of 8 leaves you at $6 out of pocket. Now, if you don't want to do those as a daily deal, because you don't need them right away, and you want to put them in a scenario, let's look at a 5 off 25 scenario using those items. Now, you're going to pick up number 2 any day deal. That's two of the Honey Made Graham Crackers for $8. And we kind of talked about this deal in a previous video in the other little food field trip. You're going to pick up two of the Jet Puff Marshmallows for $3. They're on sale. You're going to pick up five of the Snack Size Hershey's Bars. They're on sale also five for five. And then you're going to pick up an 18-pack Pepsi product for $9.50. You got a dollar coupon coming off. And then you're going to get your five off of 25 because you're at $25.50. You're really close, so make sure you check your subtotal. You got $8 total coming off, leaving you an out-of-pocket of $17.50. Now, that is a winner winner. That is 27 items because we count the individual drinks, as you know. That is $0.64 cent an item. And like I said, it is a winner winner chicken dinner scenario. Don't forget, if you picked up the jip, or the Smuckers the day before your coupon expired to submit your receipt to fetch and get another dollar off those items, making them almost free. So blessings, guys, and I'll see you again tomorrow for Thursday's Daily Deal. And, well, you want to know.